All right, everybody. Welcome to the channel to agree to disagree. My name is Brendan. This video is for all you people that are in an absolute all-out war against the Xbox One versus the PS4. Reel of opening credits. Let's do it. First of all. I just want to say, why even bother fighting about all this shit? You guys are all yelling at each other about which one's better, and in retrospect, you didn't even create the system. It doesn't help your pride in any way. Whatever people like, whatever system they like, they like better. Who cares? If you don't like the system, don't get it. Get the other one. I don't care. Everyone knows I prefer Microsoft over Sony. Is Couple reasons. One, Sony as a company as a whole, I have no faith in. They've had issues in the past with financial struggles and who knows where they're going. Two, I have been a Microsoft customer since 2001. I have not had one issue with them in 10, 13 years, uh, 11 years. And so, yes, Xbox One's gonna get my respect over the PS4 first. I'm getting both systems so everyone knows. I will have best of both worlds. Now, that being said, shut up, everybody. Everyone thinks I'm defending the Xbox, and by no means am I defending the Xbox. See, this is the issue with everyone in society today, is that everyone bases their opinions off of things that people tell them on the internet, such as IGN, such as every any kind of reviewer. If I went into every movie that I review with Joe on this channel, basing it off of reviews, I said... I saw it online, I'd be just spewing out facts that are not mine. What I'm going to do is I'm going to sit down and play both systems when I can, when I can. And then I will even make a video saying which one I think is better. I base all my opinions off of personal experience and none of us average people have had the personal experience of playing both systems considering they're not even out yet. Only the people, only the creators and some test people and people that got to test try them has got to try them. So, none of us can say which one is truly better. Yes, Xbox and Microsoft is doing some stupid marketing and doing some stupid things, trust me, I know. But does that really make the system any less capable of what the PS4 can do? No, it doesn't. It really doesn't. The gameplay could be the, I feel like the gameplay is gonna be the same exact thing on both systems. I really do. I really don't see why it wouldn't be. So if the gameplay is the bolt, same on both systems, why does anyone care? It doesn't matter which one you get. Basically, you're going to get the Xbox One over the PS4 because you like the voice command and extra things such as the TV service and the Kinect and the other things it can do. If you're just your basic gamer, you're going to get the PS4. I personally like the voice command. I think it's cool. I think the extra accessories to the Xbox is cool. I'm interested and like I said Microsoft has my faith they've had it since 2001 so yes I'm gonna buy the Xbox before and just because I'm gonna argue you with you if you instantly shoot down the Xbox it's because Sony fans piss me off sometimes they just do and I just get angry at them because they just say things just because they want to seem like everything's better listen so what if the PS4 is better don't get the Xbox I'm gonna get the Xbox I'm gonna enjoy the Xbox and that's it. Who cares? What, what, what effect on your life does it have? I only defend it because I don't like people basing their opinions off of media and reviewers. That's what everyone's been doing. The average people. That's all they've been doing. Yes, Microsoft has make it, been making it easier for people to base their opinions off the media, but you still have not tried either system. So, I ask you this. If the only people I want commenting below saying which one is better, don't even bother commenting if you're going to say... PS4 is better and I'm wrong because I won't listen to it. I'll just delete the comment. Only way you're allowed to comment something like that is if you play both systems and can prove it. Other than that, none of us can say which one will actually truly be better. And if you want to get my own personal opinion, yeah, I, I think maybe the PS4 will be better. Maybe. But also maybe the Xbox will be better. I don't know. I, I really can't even sit here and say it. And I'm just, this is just a message for all you people. To hopefully it gets through to you that you don't have the power to say which one is better until November 5th or whenever both systems come out and you can try both of them and get your own, get your own personal opinion. 
world would run so much more smoother if everyone would just get their own personal opinions based off of their own personal experiences. That's what I try to do with everything in life. This is why me and Joe created this channel. It's the channel to agree to disagree, not the channel I tell you what's right and you believe me. I say at the end of every video, comment below, let me know if you agree or disagree with me, and we can talk about it. I'm not sitting here. I review these movies. I review these games. I review the Yankees and whatnot, but I do it to just... I try to give you the facts in my and what I see in hopes that maybe you could understand something better through what I see because I really break things down and analyze them. I'm not trying to sit here and spit out information that I believe and trying to be biased by any means. I'm not biased by any means. And Joe's not trying to do that either. So, like I said, this channel is to agree to disagree. We called it that for a specific reason that we're here to agree or disagree on any subject that we review Especially the hot topic right now, the Xbox and the PS4. I am not trying to convince you that the Xbox One is better. I'm just telling you which one I'm going to get and why. And that's all I've really done this whole entire time. I'm very excited for the Xbox One. I'm also very excited for the PS4. I want both systems. I'm not going to lie. And I will have both systems eventually. But just take this message and really retain it. Don't... Be so quick to jump down the media's throats. I'll give you a perfect quick example. Xbox and eh, Xbox, uh, fuck it, I'm gonna edit that out. So if there's anything I want you to get from this video, just know that we, Joe, myself, and now Chris, our newest member to the Agree to Discreet team, are not here to make convince you of our views. We're here to show you our views and then discuss them whether you agree or disagree with them. And for the Xbox and PS4, once again, I'm going to say it one more time. If you haven't played both systems, you cannot fairly say, in a fair manner, say which one is better. You can't. It, it, I don't care what any of you say, you cannot say which one's better. You could say which one you think sounds better. You can't say which one's actually better. And if you don't agree with me, let me know, because like I said, this is the channel to agree to disagree. But please don't give me any stupid comments that the PS4 is better or the Xbox One is better, because I'm just going to delete them or just ignore them. I'm not going to care. That's not what this video is for. This video is for you to just retain that information, and hopefully I got to you. I want you to... I want people to start making their own opinions off of their own experiences rather than read it off the internet. So... Let me know what you think of my views on how to make opinions up for yourself. Let me know if I'm stupid or if I'm right. But once again, warning, do not comment down below if you're just going to say PS4 is better or Xbox One is better. Because I'm not, I, I really don't care. I'm just going to ignore the comment no matter how what it is. So this is the channel to agree to disagree.